Universal card pull. Let's see my guides, guardian angels, and uh, all of my spirit team. Please let me know what my people need to know for the week ahead. This is the week of April 15th, 2024. What is the most important messages and the most important things that would be of massive service to their life this week? Please let us know. Ooh, you guys, we haven't gotten this one for a while. This is one of my favorite. I love it. Never fear your own voice. So this is really good. You know, um, what they're telling me is that, you know, with my sharing this information, it's I love sharing this information. I love teaching. It's my favorite thing to do. Um, it, it just is what I do all the time. It's my natural inclination is to learn information, share it and teach it with others. Right. And. I just want to remind you all what a positive impact you can make in your communities, what you can do with your clients, with your coworkers, with your people, you know, with your children, with your spouses, with your friends. When you speak and use your voice so powerfully, when you are so clear in your spiritual, mental, emotional, and physical bodies, you are just Pono and you radiate a light. And then when you speak, you speak so clearly and you speak so beautifully and you can do it in a way that people around you just kind of look and are like, what? What did you say? Tell me that again. And you can help raise the vibration of the planet. So never fear your own voice. Don't hold back. You guys, one of the first things I had to learn in my psychic development training and my certification training that I got in the Angel Tarot readings from Hay House was that when I am in an intuitive reading, I must, and they have must in capital letters, I must say everything that I hear, see, feel during an intuitive reading because every single piece of information is important to that client. Now, what I didn't learn in Hay House and that certification, but I learned later in my certifications with Empowerment Inc. is that our unconscious minds take everything on. It hears everything. Our conscious mind filters out all of the excess. So the conscious mind will hear what it's supposed to, and the unconscious mind will hear everything. So when you're speaking to somebody, like when I'm doing these talks every single Monday, I'm providing a lot of information and I trust and know that your unconscious mind is getting everything I'm saying to you and your conscious mind is picking up that 126 bits. It's picking up the most important pieces of information that you need right now. Trust that that is the same with your people, with your friends. Don't fear your own voice because your voice is important. Your message is powerful. And know that it is okay for you to say what you need to say, share what you need to share, and grow from it. Okay? You're not always going to be perfect. And you're going to have to be vulnerable. And it's worth it every single time. Okay? Awesome. <laughs>